Hey everybody, today we're going to show you how to complete the side quest, the Ailing Arbor Heart here in Dragon's Dogma 2, so let's jump into it. So before you can even start this quest, you're going to have to complete four other side quests, and two of them go together, as well as the other two go together. The first two are going to be called Gift of the Bow and Trial of Archery, and then the next two are going to be called Dold Steel Cold Forge and Steeled Resolve Blazing Forge. I will leave links to all four of these down in the description below if you need guides to get these done if you haven't done so already. So to start this quest, you want to make your way over to the northwestern side of the map to the Sacred Arbor, and once you make it here, we're going to go over to the Arbor Heart. And once you go inside, you're going to end up finding Dorian. She's going to be the one that you're going to speak with to start the quest. You should get some automatic dialogue when you first see her. And then after that, you're just going to follow her into the Arbor Heart. And once she's inside where the tree is, you can speak to her again. She will give you more dialogue and this will essentially start the quest. You're going to talk to her for a little bit and she's going to eventually end up telling you about an item called Gwafentia. And the whole point of this quest is to figure out what that is. Now, the key to progressing with this quest is going to be having a pawn that speaks Elvish. If you don't and you're like me, when you first speak with her, she's going to tell you about Gwafentia and you're going to have to go figure out what it is. But it doesn't really tell you how to go and figure that out. The key is having a pawn that speaks Elvish. Now, there's a couple different ways you could do that. You might already have one. Uh, the easiest way is just to go to the Arbor Heart Rift that's literally right next to where we're standing, and you can go pick up a pawn in there that speaks Elvish. Now, the specialized skill is going to be called Woodland Wordsmith. That's what they're going to need to have. So when you're looking for a pawn, uh, just make sure that that is their specialized skill, and they'll be able to translate for you. You can also make your way over to Ko's Inn, which is the inn here at the Sacred Arbor, and you can gift her flowers and then sleep in her inn and then the next day gift her flowers again, essentially just raising your affinity with her. And after you raise her affinity high enough and sleeping in the inn uh, in between gifting her the flowers, she will eventually end up giving you the Woodland Wordsmith Tome that you can actually just give uh, to your main pawn if you would like to do that. If not, just head over to the Riftstone. And, uh, and you can pick up a specialized pawn just for this quest, or you can just keep them if you want to. After you have a pawn that speaks Elvish, you then want to go speak with Dorian again. And this time when you speak with her, obviously, since we have a pawn that can translate, it will automatically translate and we'll be able to move on to the next step. Now, a good way to tell if you did this correctly or not is to open up your map and hover over back Batal. And if you go to Brock or Smithy, there should be a big yellow circle around that area as that's where we're gonna have to go next. If you see the yellow circle, you did this correctly. If not, you're gonna need to make sure that you do have your pawn that speaks Elvish uh, and speak with Dorian. Essentially, you're just trying to trans translate what Gwifentia means in the English language which is going to translate to scale cinder. And when you speak with her again and you get the correct dialogue where she mentions scale cinder, that means you're doing it right and you'll be able to move on to the next step in Back Batal at Brocker Smithy. Now, after you make the long journey to Back Batal and work your way over to Brocker Smithy, you're going to want to go up there and speak with Sarah, who is Brocker's assistant. When you speak with Sarah, she's going to give you a little bit of dialogue and, uh, and then cue a little cut scene where she's going to talk to you about the quest that we're currently working on. You're going to sit there and listen to the remaining of her dialogue. And once that finishes, the quest will be complete. This is also going to open up another quest for you called Out of the Forest and Into the Forge. But this is how to complete the Ailing Arbor Heart here in Dragon's Dogma 2. Hopefully this video helps some of you guys out. I appreciate you watching and we'll see you in the next one.